Hello, and welcome to the reactor. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, well, hello, my fellow um, Indonesian friends, as well as the many world travelers that are out there. Um, I am honored to be Uncle... Um, I'm also wondering what Mantap means and Copa Manicopi, I think. Uh, those are a couple things I've seen in the comments that I do not know what they mean. So if you could fill me in on, on that term, I imagine it's something to do with thanks or good or something. I don't know. Um, so awesome. Well, thanks for joining me. And uh, here we go with Diwa Bujana. And Mahadini, <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm butchering that. Us Americans are not very uh, good at interpreting different languages. Um, so I know of Mr. Rudis. He is a very well-known keyboardist in the realm of super technical stuff. Uh, he's been with Dream Theater forever and also Liquid Tension Experiment. And... I didn't know this, but I um, he had, in his early days, been with Vinnie Moore, which is a, um amazing guitar player um, back in the day. He also did something with David Bowie, which I thought is really cool, and also um, with Stephen Wilson. I did not know that, so I'm, uh, I'm kind of flabbergasted that he uh, did some stuff with Stephen Wilson, which I'm going to have to check out because he's another one of my favorite heroes of music. And also Arion. He did something with Arion as well, which is another amazingly fantastic uh, musical band. Um, so anyway, I've babbled on long enough. So, uh, all right, here we go. We'll see what happens. <laughs> what a bunch of nerds, huh? Five and then six from my, on my end. Five, six, or six, I five? I thought it was actually five and six on this Five and six. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Just counting, like... you got to be a math genius to be on this level, you know? I'm sure you're cool with this, but if you get to a certain point and something happens, we can always punch you in and do an insert from that point on. But your playing is all great, so. Thank you. Sorry, can you, you want to practice it with the click track? I would say if we record to a click track, then we should. Okay, great. To make it easier to count, one, two, and one, two, three, one, two, and one, two, three. One, two, and one, two, three. Just to make it easier, you know? Counting. It's crazy. Oh, this is gorgeous. Wild. 
All right, I got to pause it here. I'm 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 flabbergasted as to the amount of complexity that's in this. I I can't. I, it's hard. I can't. I can't follow along at all. I don't. It sounds amazing. So it it sounds so smooth and easy. But yet, on the other hand, it's so hard to follow and very complex. Obviously, because she has to count everything that she's doing as she's going along, you know. And uh, and then and then Bujana, Mr. Bujana, um, is just cool as a cucumber, and just the chords that he's playing are are so damn hard, and it just seems like it's just so easy. <laughs> and the sound the sound is beautiful it's absolutely soothing very jazzy style and there's there's a lot to this that reminds me so much of Frank Zappa and some of Zappa's like freestyle stuff um, a lot of a lot of Zappa elements in this and I don't know maybe these guys were influenced by Zappa Maybe if you know more of these guys, I, I would be not surprised that they are influenced by Mr. Zappa. I'm going to guess, but I don't know. Hold on, hold on. Something crazy just happened there. It was so musically wild. So it's after this part. Um, it's after the guitar started getting heavy. And there, there were just some really, really weird things happening. I think the keyboard was timed different than the regular beat of this song, which... I don't know. I don't know. Hold on. Wow. Jesus. That sounds beautiful. Spider fingers. Oh, nice roll. Cheers. Jesus. going so fast the camera's stuck. <laughs>
Ah, oh, man. See how smooth that just transitioned into? Ah, oh, I gotta hear that again. Gorgeous. Jesus Christ, that's just sick. That's unreal. Unreal stuff. This guy's a true treasure, this guy. My word, what a what a show. Um, it is so appealing to the ears. I mean, the sound is just so amazing in this. Um, I can't say enough. And, and the complexity is so unbelievable. And uh, even even how so superior the playing is, the bassist was like disappointed. She was like, oh, <laughs> you know, it's like, you know, maybe missed a note or something or, or who knows, you know, maybe just didn't like it for whatever reason. But my God, it was perfect. It did, nothing sounded like there was anything missing. Nothing sounded out, out of place, um, even during the solos. Uh, the bass solo was fantastic, and uh, and the drum solo at the end was just bananas. Oh, what a what a gorgeous and wild song this is. Uh, I wonder if there's a theme of what um, Mr. Bujana had thought in mind when creating this, um, because it has so much complexity to it but yet it's so smooth so smooth to the ears and very you know obviously very hard to play and um but it just it's just so easy on the ears very interesting uh, i love that dynamic so it's 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 seemingly as you're just 
flying through the clouds and just enjoying the scenery. But but yet there's just so much like the complexities of life and from trillions of miles away to here and you have all that complexity while you're just flying through the space and it seems like that is what is being encompassed here in this song really wild mm, love it well thanks for recommending that that's uh, absolutely such a such a gorgeous gorgeous piece um and i love his guitar sound and his playing he makes it look so damn easy and it sounds gorgeous so uh awesome thanks for that well, hope you enjoy, and uh, well, we'll keep this rocking machine going, and keep on recommending stuff because I'm finding all kinds of things from all over the world, and I love to share newly found awesome music that other people have not yet heard, and uh, so we can keep this keep this thing going. And as things get more popular, these guys these guys get more popular. And uh, that's what we want to see. We want to see musicians out there just getting the love they deserve. So thanks again. And until the next time, cheerio.